Welcome back everyone to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to get a ton of money in RP going AFK. So the only thing that you would need for this is that you either need a controller or you guys need to do the anti AFK method which I have a video which gives you three different ways in order to do that. Before we start off with it, let's go ahead and just give our shoutouts for the day, which is going to go to these people. So thank you guys for that. And if you would like to be in the next shoutout, all you gotta do is like, subscribe, hit the post notification bell so you can see all my future videos, and then comment down something below so I can see it, and then put it in the next video. Alright, let's just go ahead and begin with the first thing. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead, go down to the link in the description of this video and bookmark the job depending on what you play on. So for me, I'm currently going to be doing this on PC, but this works for all of the old gen because for some reason in the new gen, they will not let you um, use any of the bookmark jobs. It does not show up. So I don't know when they'll actually allow that. But for right now, this only works for old gen and PC players so just go ahead bookmark the job and then what you want to do is go back into GTA 5 online after this you want to press options go over to online go over to jobs go over to play job go down to bookmarked and then scroll down until you find survivals and then the one I'm going to be doing is called the money farm so when it loads up, it should be only one player. I'm going to double check whenever I actually go and make the video um, to make sure that you can do this by yourself. So what you want to do then is just go ahead, if you want to, you can set the time of day or the weather. But once you're done with that, just confirm settings and then you want to start it up. So once it loads in, it'll like load into whatever you're at. Um, so it really doesn't matter and then for this one because it's always going to be different because it's all different consoles and PC If you guys are on PC what we're going to be doing is picking up the miniguns You want to jump up here to this little area and then you want to jump up another one And then basically all you want to do from here is you can either hide you can like crouch or whatever or you can actually go and just wait for them all to explode which is what I'm going to be doing. So what you notice is that they're actually trying to shoot me, but they actually can't because not only is the uh, they're shooting grenades so it won't launch as far, they're also getting killed by the electric fences, and the other fences behind her are so high up that the grenades they use to launch are just bouncing back at them. So from here, you should be able to just sit there. You don't have to do absolutely nothing. And then that's literally it for this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait to the end and then show you guys how much money and RP I got. But first, let's go ahead and talk about our sponsor for today's video. Are you tired of being broke in GTA Online and just wish you had more money? Then OP Mods is the website for you with its boosted accounts, modded services, and with its high star reviews on Trustpilot, this is going to be the website for you. And one thing that they provide is proof of work, so you guys don't ever have to worry about getting scammed. And they do everything from PlayStation to Xbox to even PC. And that'll be linked down in the description. And don't forget to use discount legit for a 5% discount on your purchases. Thank you and back to the video. I also want to let you guys know, if you are more interested in the RP than the money, if you guys manually kill them, you get 13 RP per kill. So, you know, using the minigun like I'm doing is a really quick and just a fast way to get rid of them. So I'm getting 13 RP per kill. Now, once you get to like probably killing like 100 people, it'll probably stop giving you RP. But there is a good amount of RP that you can just get from manually killing them. If you guys are interested in money though, then you don't have to do this. So after reaching wave um, 13 on um, 14 currently, you stop getting RP for the kills that you do. 
So at that point, there's really no reason to manually kill them unless you just want it to go by faster, which is what I'm currently doing right now. So for the one for PC, it's actually going to be up to 20 rounds. Now that doesn't mean it's amazing because what I realize is that each round is actually like 20 people you have to kill. While well, usually when it when it's only like 10 rounds, it's like 60 you have to kill per round. So even though there's a lot more rounds, it's about the same number of people that you have to kill. And I'm not too sure if that even matters like at the end total. But I just know that for the number of people that do spawn change depending on how many rounds there are. Okay, so we just passed the survival with um, 20 ways being part of it. For this, we got $24,375 and $1,929 RP. Now, I want to keep this in mind. I, it does seem like a little bit of low money, but this is literally something that's AFK. And what you can do is you can actually um, get a bunch of jobs and make a playlist. So, for example, I'm going to go back into free mode to show you guys a playlist that I have set for AFK stuff. So, I just loaded back into the game. I realized that I literally kept the minigun from the last thing. So, what you want to do is you guys want to press options, go over to online, head over to playlist. And then you actually either want to get a bookmark playlist from like a friend or something or you can create your own. So the one I have set is for an AFK playlist. It basically just has five different ones that you guys can use. And this one's for RP, but I only have one of them. And so all you want to do is if you guys want to create a playlist, all you want to do is go ahead and you can add whatever you want. And that's really it. So hopefully you guys do enjoy this video. Hopefully it helped you out. If you did, then leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this. And with that being said, you guys have a great one. Stay safe out there, and goodbye.